Right, we're getting inside into the kitchen. Oh yeah. Yeah, the chef. Take the garlic. In Israel, you can also order the garlic uh, with, uh, without the peel. Peel. You can have it probably. Once you peeled it, you peel a bunch of them. Then you throw it in a pot. You add, uh, you know what silan is? No. Silan is a honey made of dates. Can you get that? I never, no, I've never heard of that before. Seriously? Yeah. I'm going to bring you some to taste. Yeah. Cool. And you made out of dates. So this is specifically like bees collecting... It's not bees. It's not really honey. Okay, so it's not real honey. Okay, yeah, it's yeah. So, so it's like a... Probably... Ah! Mostly sugar. Wow! From the palm tree. So what do you call this again? Silan. Silan. It's a, Silan, yeah, it's Silan. an Arabic, uh, it's an Arabic uh, dish, not dish, just uh, sweet. Wow, well, it's very much like, um, it's very much like honey actually, but it has that kind of little kind of hint of date in it. But look at the, look at the color, it's very, very intensely black. And it's very thick, yeah, it's very, very thick. Yeah. Wow, mmm. So you need this. Do you, you think? You can do it also with honey, right? Do you, do you think you could substitute with honey? Yeah. That's that's the main thing I want to hear. The chef says yeah. Yeah. So you basically, you take these, you put them in in, in the pot. Yeah. And you add oil and honey. That would be it, no? Yeah. With honey, it's a bit different. But you can get it uh, wherever you are. It's called palm honey. Okay. From the palm tree. In okay. Pot. You can get it over there. Uh, what do you have in different? It's like a corn syrup. Corn syrup. If you mix that with enough, uh, you can mix it with a little bit of honey, and then you put some uh, oil. Yeah. Not to cover. You put uh, two thirds of the height of the garlic. Yeah. Because the garlic sink and the liquid is. Spending. Yeah. So it go up. Yeah. And that's it on the simmering fire for uh, sometimes mix until they get the color right and until they're a bit soft and you take Okay, the fire. what would you say roughly how long would usually take? 15, 20 minutes. And really low heat wouldn't it be? Like really yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, like a mix. Yeah, 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 yeah. A little bit. Because otherwise the honey is becoming. Uh, yeah, it start, yeah, it start, yeah, starts burning. Yeah, 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 yeah. But we also add thin to. Uh, to it? Time, time, uh, time, time. Oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah, okay. Brilliant. That's amazing, guys. Anything. That's amazing, guys. What well, we can do is just throw this inside and leave it there for a few minutes. I hope for the best. <laughs> so here we are. Um, this is amazing. I'm learning something new today. This is a recipe I'm gonna bring home, and I'm. You're gonna have to try this because. You have never ever tried garlic like this in your life. It's amazing. We make you a jar of the garlic. <laughs> very good, very good. You take it as is. Beautiful. These are. They're almost like they're almost like a little bit like something like toffee flavor in it. Do you know what I mean? Like it's amazing, you know. I'm blown away. I've, I've got a taste experience and a recipe that I'm going to try at home. There you go. There's plenty more to come. Brilliant. Thank you, guys. You're welcome.